Hello, you are only uh, welcome to today's um, class on number systems. Okay, so uh, we have a question here, and we need to convert the number that we have, the question on the board, we need to convert this number, that is 1056 in base 16. The base 16 here, another way we can mention base 16 is hexadecimal, so we call this the hexadecimal. Now we have to convert it to octal. Octal means that we are converting it to base 8. So in other words, we are converting from base 16 to base 8. That's what we are doing. So there are so many ways we can do this. Let's look at one of the ways we can, we can do this. So it's very easy. We'll just write 1056, which is in base 16. We have to convert... So we have to convert each of the digits here using four bits. We have to write each of the digits and we have to represent them with four bits or four digits. And then, so what I'm doing is that I'm first converting this to binary. And when I convert it to binary, I'll convert it from binary to octal. Binary means that I'm converting it to base two. Okay, so when you are converting one to base two, what's the answer when you convert one to base two? We have one, two, four, 8, 16, so Okay, so we have 1 We want to write 1, but I want to represent 1 with 4 digits 1 goes into 1, just a 1 like that So if you want to represent it with 4 bits, you just have to bring zeros in front um, after the 1 But we just need to make sure that the number of numbers here are 4 1, 2, 3, 4 then 0, we want to represent 0 using 4 bits, you just write 0, 0, 0, 0. We want to represent 5 using 4 bits, you have 1, 1, you have 0, 0. We want to represent 6 using 4 bits, 4 divide 6, 1, with a remainder of 2. 2 divide that 2, 1, without any remainder. So, sorry, this zero. So we've been able to represent each of the digits which are in the dotted decimal or in the stand. We've been able to represent them um, using four bits each. Okay, good. The reason why we use four bits is because it is in octal. Okay, sorry, it's in hexadecimal. And the hexadecimal is 16. And 16 can be written as 2 as 4. So we represent using four bits. If it was in octal, we represent it using three bits. Okay. Good. So now, these numbers that we have, we we'll write them using the same order that it occurs here. So the 1 is 0, 0, 0, 1. The 0 is 1, 2, 3, 4. The 5 is 0, 1, 0, 1. And then the 6 is 0, 1, 1, 0. So now we have, this is in binary. In other words, when you convert this to binary, any method you use, this is the answer you are supposed to get. Good. Now we have to convert this binary to octal. Okay, so this is in binary now. now. We have to convert it from binary to base 8. The base 8 is the octal. There are so many other ways, so many ways you can use to convert this, but I want to use this way. So we want to convert it to base 8. Since it is written as 2 as 3, we have to create 3 divisions. So we divide this into 3. So we take 1, 2, 3, we bring that division. 1, 2, 3, we bring that. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Like that. This is zero. So, so what you just do is that you subject them to exponents of 1, 2, 4, 1, 2, 4, 1, 2, 4, 1, 2, 4, 1, 2, 4. So you multiply 1 by 0. That's 0. 2 times 1 is 2. 4 times 1 is 4. So we add that. So here is 0. 2 times 1 is 2. 4 times 0 is 0. 1 times 1 is 1, 4 times 0 is 0, 2 times 2 is 0. This will multiply, we get 0, 1 times 1 is 1. So 4 plus 2 is 6, so let me just write the 6 there. Now we are done. The answer we have is 1, 0, 1, 2, 1, 0, 1, 2, 6. So we take the first number, 0, we take the second number, we take this and that. So this is in this case. So that's how we solve it. So we've been able to convert this which is in hexadecimal of base 16 we've converted it to base 8 we first converted it to base 2 you can use any method but you are supposed to get this answer we will convert it from base 2 using this and this is the answer in base 8 so thank you very much for your time and um, it's been good having this class with you 
and all the best to you. If you have any other way of solving this, you can put it in the comments. I also do want to um, go through. Thank you and bye bye. Yes.